is up you guys so today i am doing a haul for you i feel like i haven't done a haul like a clothing haul or any kind of haul recently um because when i go out shopping and stuff i don't buy like that much and by the way i'm sorry if the lighting's a little weird it's raining outside right now so i'm just using like natural lighting but it's still pretty bright so if the lighting changes or whatever that's that is why but anyways so i went to a few stores i went to like hmm hmm hollister and a bunch of other stuff so let's get started hmm hmm it, it's flipped um <laughs> the first thing oh we got a bag inside the bag. We'll get to that later. Uh, the first thing that I got at H&M was only this one thing, because H&M didn't have that much nice cute things, was this shirt. This is like a, uh, I don't know what color, but it's a pink shirt <laughs> that says, be yourself with like, flower like a rose and uh, bees and it looked cute so I've also been seeing this color a lot recently for the like springtime and the, okay <laughs> we'll put it over here right oh okay okay and we went up oh, that's, that's a gift okay I went to Charm and Charlie's I only bought one thing it's a little bit bigger but all all that I bought from there was some hoop hoop errands <laughs> it's not focusing there we go <laughs> some like medium hoop earrings because I have like really big hoop earrings, but I wanted like, you know, smaller ones, but not super, super small. So I got like medium size. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Moving along. Then I went, okay. I got it. Yeah. Okay. Then I went to Macy's and what I bought, I only bought one thing from Macy's as well and that was just a pair of shorts they had like this um dark green shorts that i've been seeing a lot of that color as well and they didn't have my size but that's okay so um i don't own any color shorts like this they're all like dark wash denim or light wash denim hi Leila. um <laughs> so I picked up a pair of these and these uh, from the brand Celebrity Pink they're super soft and they're like super stretchy which I really like um, and yeah that's it that would look cute with the the other shirt that I showed you then hold on I'm missing one bag okay then we went to Layla stop snipping everything Marshalls and it's a big bag but not a lot of stuff okay so I'm going to Portugal literally this Saturday Sunday. I keep saying Saturday and Sunday. So if this video goes up on Sun Saturday, then then I'm by the time this video goes up, most likely I'm already on the plane. So yeah. Um, but anyways, I usually don't have trouble sleeping on the planes, but my mom does, and she's always saying to buy these neck pillows to put around and stuff but like like I said I usually never have a problem sleeping on the plane like if I'm next to the window I just kind of lean my head against the window and it's fine but lately I feel like when I like the most recent 
flight I went on was Turkey and Turks and Caicos, but I don't think I fell asleep on on the plane because it was I believe it was a short ride if I remember. But the last time I remember falling asleep was when I was going to Florida and my neck ended up hurting. So, you know, it doesn't hurt to get one of these little little things, you know, so you just kind of crash. <laughs> Um, and this is memory foam travel neck pillow. It's pretty, pretty nice. It's like, it's soft, but it has like, um, some cushion to it. It's not like super flat. Cause like my mom was looking at one that she liked like the outside of it, but it was like when she would put her head on it, it would go down and deflate a lot. So she ended up getting one like this too, but she got one in black. I don't know where to put everything. We'll just put you there. Then, that's my mom's. And then, what I bought was, I've been, okay. The thing is, when I travel with my makeup, I carry, like, three different bags, mainly because, like, um, the, some of, I have, like, a, uh, traveling brush case, but it's not, like, those round ones, and it's from Tarte, and I really love it, but the thing is, some of my brushes, mostly like my Real Technique brushes and stuff like that, don't fit in there. Um, so I have to bring another thing with all my other makeup and it's just, it's a hassle. And I saw this <laughs> at TJ Maxx. I also saw one on Ulta that I really liked, but this one was a lot cheaper. <laughs> And it just opens up and you have like a little pocket here to put stuff in and then you can fit other stuff in here like eyeshadow palettes and makeups and stuff like that. That's also another thing is like when I bring eyeshadow palettes sometimes it doesn't fit in all of my bags so that tends for me to bring more and it's it's, it's a hassle so I, I just thought everything will be nice and compact in this and everything so I'm excited and then apparently I think you can also attach another bag on here because I don't know why there's a hook here I'm assuming you could put another bag um, which is nice so I'm sorry, I keep looking at the viewfinder and not the, the lens. I just keep checking to make sure we're our focus. So that's what I got. The hat, and, and then there's a zipper in the back that you can put stuff to, and it goes pretty deep. Like my, my hand goes all the way down here. So, yeah. Okay. Next, we went to love culture. Now, we went to this other mall that I usually don't go to because I'm like, they don't really have like a lot of my stores there. And this other mall that is literally like a little bit further down is, it has more of my stuff, like more of my clo the clothing stores that I go to and stuff like that. And that mall used to have, um, love culture in it and that's actually how I found love culture and then they closed down and I was really sad and I was like now I gotta buy everything online and that's what I've been doing and then <laughs> the other day when I was shopping my mom said love culture and I was like love culture they're here like I, I was like they closed down in the other mall I didn't know they opened up here so I got really excited <laughs> so we went into love culture I only bought one thing though from right did I, did I, did I, did I? oh no just kidding I bought three things um I'm really excited about this this I've never owned one I've always wanted to own one but I'm like I don't know how it's gonna look Layla stop sniffing everything please um I never knew how it was gonna look 
like I assumed it was going to look nice because I am a, on the taller side. But I was like, uh, I don't know. <laughs> so, I, okay. How do I show It's a jumpsuit, or if you're Australian, a play suit. I think that's what they call it. And it's just, it's hard to show you because it's like, it's crisscrossed like that. And then it has like this mesh, mesh, lace. No, that's, I don't, lace. I don't know. It, it has like this material. I don't know what material it is. And then it just goes all the way down. And I thought it was really cute. And then I bought some shirts because I've been seeing these kind of like shirts also seems to be very in style right now. It's an off the shoulder. I I haven't been a fan of off the shoulder for a very long time until I did the Just Conti, uh, I copied Just Conti's Instagram for a week and I, ha I bought a black off the shirt, off the shirt, off the, off the shoulder shirt and I actually really loved like the black and the white but the only thing is like I couldn't wear that out because the white leggings that I wore from Love Culture actually were very, uh, um, not thin but they were see-throughs so it was a problem. So if I would ever to wear those out, like I did at Disney World, I would have to wear a flannel or something tied around my waist. So you don't see everything. <laughs> but anyways, so I bought this. This is like a pinky salmon-y color. I don't, I don't really know, but it, it's cute. And I've been seeing like this, this like stretchy material a lot recently like on on top of dresses and stuff i feel like that that was very popular back in the day and now it's making like a comeback so i bought a shirt like that and i also bought one same kind of shirt just in black you don't gotta have a variety even though i have one that's black that has ruffles like it has ruffles Oh, it has ruffles on the bottom. But it is a cropped shirt. And this one is like a full length, so it's a little bit, you know. I can wear it with any kind of shorts or pants or whatever. So, it's more wearable right now for me. And then, <laughs> I have not one, but two bags from Hollister, <laughs> which is funny because I used to never really shop at Hollister, but recently since um, I started going to Hollister mainly for the bathing suits because Hollister has really cute bathing suits, um, and the first time that I went, I bought one, and this was before Alicia Marie was actually um, like a, a spokesperson spokesperson or a model for Hollister and stuff but ever since she's been there I've been tempted to go more because they have cute things and I don't know I feel like before when I was younger they don't really have like my kind of style stuff but now they got some cute stuff and I'm gonna I'm gonna show you <laughs> um now I don't know if I bought these Pants? No, these these pants are from from Macy's or no from Coles. Coles, yeah. And I also bought shorts, but I already worn them and they need to be washed, so that's why I don't have it. But it's the same color, just in shorts. Cause I needed some pants, and I don't really have like this light wash denim, so. I got that. So much stuff. <laughs> okay. Now that Macy's up all the way. Um, I bought some a few bathing suits, but we're not we're not, I'm not angry, but we're gonna go into the clothes first. So I went to Hollister first before I went to Love Culture and I bought the same kind of shirts. <laughs> 
that they had at Love Culture in Hollister. <laughs> and I bought these because these, I actually saw this red one on a mannequin with black dark wash, well no, was it black? No, it was like a, a really dark washed denim, like almost black. I think it was black, I'm not 100% sure, I don't really remember. But I saw on the mannequin with overalls, sh like short overalls, and I tried it on, but they didn't have my, my size. I tried a medium, but a medium did not fit, so. And they didn't have a size bigger, so I bought this one instead, so. I just bought the shirt, and I think it looks super cute. I don't own any overalls. And then I also bought... I bought another like light pink one. I think it's really cute. I don't know why. Now a lot of the times that I shop, I kind of have like, like what would just Conti get, you know? Because I really like her style, and her style is like simple but also like fashion. I, I like not sophisticated. I don't really know. She she describes her her style as cute but comfy. And simple but I don't I don't know just something about her like the thing she buys it's like really cute and my mom keeps saying like I need to buy clothes like different kind of clothes that to like wear to work and stuff when I start working and you know and all that so anyways I bought this because I like the color but also I'm feeling like just comfy with like this kind of shirt too might be a bad reason to buy some things, but whatever. I still like it, you know. Um, and then I bought a few bralettes. I bought one in maroon, a white one, and a like a light blue turquoisey. No, this is I don't know a blue color. <laughs> And then I bought this shirt. Again, I saw this shirt on the mannequin and it looked nice, but it was tight on the bottom. So just looks like this. They also had it in blue and I think another color. I'm not 100% sure, but I like the white one. I feel like the colors show more. And then at the bottom, like down here, and had it tied and it looks super cute. I actually prefer it being tied than just you know just like this because it looks a little too baggy on on me and I don't know I just I really like tie things <laughs> okay now for the bathing suits well I have one more clothing item which we'll get later I bought this bottom which I think is really cute I don't own any like print I used to but I don't fit in them anymore <laughs> um so I thought this was super cute it's high-waisted I've always wanted high-waisted sh uh not shorts um bathing suits but I never were able to find ones and when I did story of my life I never had my size <laughs> so finally I got them and it's super cute and it has like um a cutout on the on the side like you know, which is nice and i don't think i bought the matching top with it because you can just wear like a black top or any of these colors with it i also have like a bright orange one that i think would look nice with that I think. yeah no I did not buy the matching top, but I bought, I did buy a set. I bought this color green, which is the color green shorts that I was talking about, which I don't know why I think when I see color shorts like this, like this color and stuff or pants, I don't know why. I always think like Kim Possible because like this is like kind of like the color that she wore. Even though she's a cartoon. Anyways. <laughs> but I still love it. That would... Kim Possible is a good show. Sadly, it's not on anymore. But it's all good. 
Um, <laughs> so yeah, so I bought this, and it, ha it just has like ruffles on the side. I actually have the same exact bathing suit bottom that is a bright orange, and I really like that, so I got this one in green. And then I just got the matching, one of the matching tops. They had like two different matching tops. So I bought this one. This one just like goes yeah, over the neck and then like that. And it has like a little detailing in the middle. And I thought it was super cute. And then the last thing that I bought from Hollister. I've already been here for like 20 minutes filming. I feel like I'm going to hate myself when I edit this because I'm like, i got to work on talking less, like, because I just ramble so much. <laughs> Lately, all my videos has been really, really long. So, I ended up buying this rom romper. Um, it's like a high neck, um, not like super high neck, but like a halter top. That's what it's called. Halter top type of thing. And then it just has these flowers on it and I wasn't crazy about it like when, when my mom showed me I was like eh, uh, I don't know <laughs> but when I tried it on I actually ended up really liking it and this is say like what I'm you guys can't really see but it has the same stretchy material like the shirts that I showed you and I feel like it's it's in season <laughs> because it's just I've seen, I went to a few stores yesterday and a lot of the stores I saw had this stretchy material. So, anyways. That, I feel like, I never do big hauls like this because I talk. <laughs> oh, hold on. <laughs> I forgot one thing. From Hollister. Also, I bought a jacket. Cause I don't really have a spring jacket. I mean, that I have a sp like spring jackets that are light, light material and stuff. But for those days, like today when it's raining and a little cold, I got that's a jacket. I have not worn it yet because um, I tried wearing it one day because I thought it was gonna be cold and it ended up being like 74 degrees that day. I was like, oh well. Brought the jacket for now. But you know, it's all good. And I think it's super cute. And it just has like, it has buttons to button it and then it has a, a zipper. And I, I don't know, I thought, I thought it was cute. And it has um, little like patches on the sleeves. And then like, <laughs> it's hard to show you guys that jacket, but it's cute. <laughs> My mom has a similar one, but she has a winter one like like this color and stuff, but I didn't like those kind of jackets for the winter um, and everything. So then I saw this and I was like, oh, that's cute. And I've been looking for a jacket like this. So yeah, I'm, I'm excited to wear it. I haven't worn it yet, but oh, there goes everything, Layla. I'm sorry, I woke you up. And I scared you because you're such a scary cat. <laughs> Literally. Like, we in focus? We in focus. My camera just stopped automatically. He doesn't want me to talk anymore. <laughs> um, but like I was saying, I literally just said boo like that to Layla. She's like, <gasps> but anyways. With that being said, I hope you guys liked this video. And if you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below of... Leave a comment down below what your favorite store is, whether it's online or in store, whatever. And also let me know in the comments down below, do you like to shop in store or online? <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next video, which I don't know when that will be since I'm going to Portugal. I do plan to vlog out there, but I never vlog around family, <laughs> only with my friends. So, um, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> anyway, that is all. So, I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out.
see the little cutie? Yeah, look at the little cutie! Cutie! <laughs> You're my cutie! <laughs> I, oh, I think Layla secretly loves the camera. Right, my baby, because she got all excited and she was looking directly at the camera. Yeah, you love taking pictures for your Instagram. Yeah, I'll have Layla's Instagram link down below. <laughs> Go follow her. I mean, look at how cute she is. How could you not follow that cute face? On. I'm gonna go see if it's calling my house. I bet you it's junk mail. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know who it was because they didn't, they didn't leave a message. So, flip teller. As I was saying, 